everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Tasa Lakela, and if you're new here, please go and click that subscribe button down there. Um, let's just get into the video. I didn't expect to be doing something like this so soon, and I'm a little ashamed of myself that I have zero self-control, which is how this video happened. So, um, I was really impressed with the last haul video, like these cool t-shirts that I got from Mr. Price. So, I was feeling sorry for myself one day, went onto the Mr. Price app, and picked up a bunch of things. And like, you know like if you go to Superbolus or something, you're paying like 349 Rand for one item of clothing. And I paid like 445 Rand and I got five things, which I think is great. So yeah, um, I was contemplating, do I film another haul video, do I not? And then I was like, I really like watching haul videos, so I'm just gonna do it. Okay, so let's just get into it. So on the app, like you with your first purchase, if it's over 500 Rand, you get a discount of 100 Rand. So that's what I did. And my original total was 509 Rand 98. And with shipping, like I ordered it on a Thursday and it came on the Friday, which was great. And that cost 45 Rand. So the first thing that I picked up, just because I, it was 100 Rand, so I was like, there's absolutely no way that I can't get this. It is a super cute jumpsuit, which I will try and try on. Um, it's just gray, it's long, it's a cold shoulder. I got mine in a UK 16. I feel like that is one beef I always have with Mr. Price. Like their sizing is crazy. I have like a dress, my dresses from Woolworths are in a medium. And I go to Mr. Price, I'm in the double X now. But it is what it is, and I'm like, as long as it fits nicely, I'm happy. That's kind of all that matters to me. This was, like I said, 100 grand, which I thought was so cool. Okay, guys, so like, ignore the mess behind me, but this is what the jumpsuit looks like. I'm too scared to zoom out and like let my room be. It's just very cute. Very like versatile, wear it with whatever, whenever. Yeah. The next thing that I saw and I was like, oh, I need this because I'm branching into shirts is this super cute ruffle shirt. Like, just with some boyfriend jeans, you know, a pair of shorts, some cool heels. I just think this is such a cute spring outfit without being too colorful, but you know, you still got like the playfulness and the funness. It's great. Is funness a what? I'm not sure, but this is it. This was um, Ruffle Shut 119.99. And I got this in an extra large. Um, this is the shirt. I just thought that this is so cute. Like I love the sleeves, they're so adorable. And it definitely needs an iron. But yeah, this is it. Um, the other two things that I got are just for gym, which I need to get back to because I've just been like working on school stuff. So I haven't been to gym in over a week, which I'm not proud of. But who knows, maybe I'll go after this. So it's just um, splattered leggings. I probably won't try these two things on because it's just workout stuff. Um, yeah, it's a size large. And I paid 80 Rand for this, which I thought was like really nice. And then I bought a pair of cycling shorts, but for gym and not for like fashionable purposes. Not because I don't like the trend, I don't think I could pull it off. Like there's no way that I could look as great as Kim Kardashian does when she wears these and her heels. Um, so this was 69.99. So the last thing that I got is just a pair of block heels, which I'm holding the wrong way. Um, if anybody knows me, I am big on block heels because I don't trust myself with anything thinner, like stilettos, no. So these are very cute as well. Um, I will show you guys what it looks like. These are the shoes. I think they're super cute. Um, they tie up at the ankle tie them up really badly but yeah I don't know I think it's just a very cute outfit with 
this shirt and these jeans and I feel like I'm ready for a night out or like just like to go to a really good burger joint. And that is the end of the stuff that I got from Mr. Price. But I did get another pair of shoes from Legit. So I'm going to describe them to you and then I want you to like go down to the comments and tell me what you think about the shoe. It is green, it's also a block heel and it has spiders on it. So pause this video, scroll down, tell me what you're thinking and then come back and like play the video again. So I saw these shoes in July I think and then I was double minded to, about should I get them, should I not get them and then they were on sale from 400 Rand to 250. So I was like, you know what, it's a sign. I should get them. So this is what they look like. I think they're so cute. Like, these are in a size 6 and there's like a little bumblebee on the side of it. So super cute. Also, these are the last pair of shoes. I think they're just so cute. Obviously not with these jeans, but with a pretty dress. Very like ladylike, Alice in Wonderland, Mad Hatter, probably more along the lines of the Mad Hatter. The last part of this haul is, I went into Diskem, and if many of you go into Diskem, you know that you don't go into Diskem knowing what you want. Diskem tells you what you want. So, um, I've been looking for derma blading blades. Blades to like derma plane, derma blade. I'm not entirely sure what the term is. But threading is hella expensive in Johannesburg compared to where I'm from. So in Joburg, I pay like 80 Rand to get like just my upper lip threaded here. And then at home, that's like 20 Rand. So um, my friend Mishka, she's great. She introduced me to, I'm going to say the name wrong. Dumb, I'm going to say dumb planing to just shave this off. Dumb plane this fluff off. So these three blades were 30 rand and like how cheap is that? And then the next thing that I bought is not for after dumber planing or dumber blading, whichever the word is, is a men's aftershave. So this is the Nivea Men Sensitive Post Balm Shave. Um, this was also bought on the recommendation of Mishka. So she told me that this can also be used as a primer. And then I was very interested by that. So I kind of went onto YouTube and then I checked it out. And a lot of people have been using this as a primer. I've used it Sunday. Today's, today's Monday. Is today Tuesday. Today's Tuesday. So I've used it two days. And I'm pretty pleased with it. Like it gets a little bit shiny and oily by my nose. But I guess it doesn't say... No one says it's mattifying primer, but my makeup does look pretty good after I put use this. Yeah. And then the last three things are just cosmetics. I... Cosmetics. I bought this nail polish because I felt like I needed a spring color. And um, this is in the shade Perfect Match from Essence. And how cute are my nails? And then I got a new eyeliner, which I'm currently in love with. It like just looks like you use like a felt up marker on your a very thin tiny felt up marker on your eyelid um look at that pigment guys look at it it's so good so this is the essence eyeliner pen in waterproof be careful not to get the super fine pen because that looks very similar and it doesn't work as well because i used to have that one and then the tip is just really really long so it doesn't really get you a really nice precise eye but this is great and the last thing i got is a gloss i never wear glosses this is also from essence i guess this was just a mini essence haul there um it is the shine 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 wet look lip gloss um i'm not entirely sure yet if i can pull this off but i wore it today and it's very pretty for like the first hour that's like the only thing with glosses they don't exactly last forever and also like it's really windy outside so my hair kind of just gets stuck there not the greatest look it's a very pretty color and i hope to make use of it okay guys that is basically all that i bought this past week and yeah let me know if you like whole videos 
if you want to buy something or you want to recommend something for me to buy i hope that you guys enjoyed this video um give it a like give it a share um comment down below what is your favorite color and i will see you guys next week